How do we like this, by the way? How do we like this? I'm like filming down here because I'm like, I love this wall so much. And I'm like, this is like the most beautiful background. So, hello, I'm filming in my living room today. We are doing a surprise video today. It's an extra video from this week. My girlfriend came over and she redid all the artwork that was behind here and I was like, yeah, let's use it. So back here, in case you guys don't remember, used to be my Prada Marfa and the Prada Marfa is officially retired and I've replaced with these beautiful pieces over here. I'll link Citizen Atelier and my friend Alessandra down below. So Christmas came a little early this year and I wanted to share it with you guys. It's a new bag. I mean, you could probably tell from the title because I decided I'm gonna start writing the name of my handbags, like what I'm revealing in the title just because I feel like it's so much more practical for you guys as opposed to doing like a surprise reveal. Um, yeah, I just think it makes more sense. Like doing it like I used to do back in the day. So let me, get, let me know in the comment section down below if you agree with that. So today's video is going to be the Balenciaga Small Hourglass in the Mock Croc teal reveal oh that rhymed so this handbag was a little early christmas present that i got and i thought instead of waiting until what i got for christmas video i thought i would just show it to you guys right now because of all the restrictions that are coming out we're doing like family meetups and like christmas parties because they're more like one-on-one -on -one. let's just exchange gifts have a nice dinner more intimate and small and so this hourglass bag guys can we talk about it for a second? So first off, this bag was purchased on Farfetch using my own promo code, might I add, which I actually have a new one that is coming back into play right now. So I will write it here so you guys can take a look. If it is an additional 10% off on pretty much everything with a few restrictions that I will leave down below. So this is partially a Christmas present, partially a credit. I got a Farfetch gift card for Christmas and I decided to use it towards this. I had some credit in my account and I just, I went for it. So this bag is the, its actual name is the Balenciaga Hourglass in Mock Croc in the small size in color teal. It comes with a crossbody and a beautiful top handle. What I love so much about this crossbody strap is the, I don't know if you guys can see this close up, but see how like the perforations, they go all the way here. Like literally you could have the crossbody strap be the same length as the top handle. I love that you can go short and I love that you can also go long. I am definitely on the shorter side. Like ideally I like my crossbody here. I kind of like it like right under the boob, but I know a lot of women like it here and some like it even longer. So that's what I love about the versatility of this bag. I also think the color of this bag is incredible. It's also a color I've never seen. This is not a color I had seen anywhere else. The only place I have seen this color is on Farfetch. And that's what I love the most about shopping on that website because they source from luxury stores all over the world. They basically have they have inventory that nobody will ever have. Like, it, it's almost impossible to find stuff is always on Farfetch. So the fun colors, the pop of colors, I feel like a lot of luxury stores sometimes only stock the neutrals or they'll only stock a certain color hardware. With Farfetch, you'll get the full array. By typing in Balenciaga Hourglass Small, the amount of options you get versus going to like another luxury store, which will probably have three or four different options, Farfetch has like 20 options. So when I saw this color, I was like, yes, please. You guys already know how much I love a good mock croc. Added me a pastel. I was like, ooh, yes, please. Originally, I was worried. I was like, am I making a mistake considering it's winter? But so many beautiful like oatmeal and camels go so beautifully with this that I'm actually finding myself pulling out more of my colored and pastels bags at this time of year than I actually did this summer. Because this summer, my outfits are kind of brighter and bolder and I usually end up going with more of a neutral purse as opposed to in the winter when I just go ham on my accessories because my outfits are much more neutral. I wear a lot more black, camel, 
you name it, I wear it. I thought what would be good to talk about in this video is the comparison between the Micro, which is the actual bag that I originally purchased that made me fall in love with said bag. I actually use this bag way more than I thought I would. It also has a teeny tiny cute little crossbody, but if you follow me on Instagram, you already know that this is how I carry it. I have posted quite a few night out pictures with this bag. I literally feel like this is the cutest, bougiest going out bag. I got this in the mock croc with the black hardware. I know so many people made fun of me when I bought this bag, but I'm laughing considering how much I've used this bag. So this is what made me fall in love with it. And when I realized how much I love this bag, I thought it would be really nice to add like a day version of this bag here. So it does come in a medium size, which is larger. I'll include a picture here so you guys can see what it looks like. But for me, I, I think that this size is perfect. If it's my wallet, if it's my phone, if it's, I have the iPhone 12 Pro, it's perfect in here. If it's everything I need on the daily, I find the medium version, it, I find it's too stiff of a bag to be in the medium size. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that is how I feel about this bag. Let's do a little ins and out. So you have the Balenciaga signature hourglass logo right here. It just says Balenciaga at the bottom. Obviously that nice stiffer top handle and the crossbody that I just showed you guys. This hardware is a like brushed silver. It's almost like a boy bag type of hardware, like that darker silver. And you open it up and it is really self-explanatory. It is literally just a square pocket. It does not even have like a side slit or anything. It has an embossed Balenciaga right here. And then you have the silver Balenciaga written right here. At the back, you have a little side slit pocket which does fit your phone standing up and no feet at the bottom. Your hardware here on the side has a Balenciaga written here and the closure on the hardware is just this like little like harness hook. Does that even make sense? Is that how we're describing it, a harness hook? Let me just show you guys the difference between the two sizes. So the micro is obviously significantly smaller. So let me just show you guys the difference in sizes. The micro is obviously significantly smaller from the front also from the side, also from the back, but it is the exact same aesthetic as the small one. It still has that small little pocket at the back, which is actually very practical for valet and coat check tickets. That is what I've been using it for, and it is incredibly practical for that reason alone. So seeing them side by side, this is obviously the user-friendly version of the impractical version, but they are both equally loved. Just wanted to pull back to show you guys how cute it looks just with this outfit, for example. It really gives that pop, that aesthetic, that like extra pretty look when you have something that's like not so extra. I mean, it's a very basic outfit. Throw something like this on and it all of a sudden just looks like much more thought out of and much more put together. I will make sure to link it down below and I will include my new promo code for Farfetch, which is valid, I think, for four to six weeks. I'll put all the dates down below as well as the T's and C's. So the next video that we're going to have on here is most likely going to be my What I Got For Christmas video, which this will obviously be included in. Um, but that will be probably the 25th or 26th. So in the meantime, since I probably will not speak to you before Christmas, at least not on YouTube, if you follow me on Instagram, we will definitely be chatting and conversing. But with that being said, I wanna wish you all a very, very, very happy holiday season. I hope you are all with your families, with your loved ones, and you are having the most incredible time off. It is well-deserved. I'm giving us all Tons of kisses, so much love, so many positive vibes, and I will see you after Christmas, guys. I don't have anything else to say besides I love you so, so much, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Mwah.